Hi guys, it's Robin from The Balanced Life, and today I'm gonna to lead you through a relaxing Pilates stretching routine. We're gonna start lying down on our mat. Go ahead and go all the way down to your back with your feet flat on the floor, knees bend. Let's start with the arms resting long down by our sides. I want this routine to be something you can come to when you just need to move your body a little bit, a perfect workout for the end of the day or a little break in the middle of your day. So let's just take a moment to breathe. Take a nice big inhale and a nice big exhale. Good. As you breathe, can you relax your body into the mat? Feel the tension melting off of your body down into the ground softening your muscles, your face, your jaw, your shoulders, and just letting go of tension. Good. We'll start with some pelvic curls. Inhale to prepare, and as you exhale, flatten your back. Roll your hips up into a bridge position, reaching the fingertips long towards your heels, your knees stretching over your toes. Inhale, and exhale, roll down. Good, again, rolling up. Pressing firmly into the mat with your feet, reaching the knees to lengthen the front of the thigh. Soften the chest and roll down. Good, rolling up. And rolling down. We're gonna add a little variation on the next one. So roll up to the top of your bridge. You're gonna drop your right hip bone roll down along the right side of your spine and come back through center roll up through center up to the top drop your left hip bone roll down along the left side of your spine this is going to help to really release tension in the lower back and come back through center let's do one more on each side so at the time i'm filming this video i'm about three months postpartum after having my twins and this just slow moving stretches. It feels so good to help release that tension from holding babies and all of the things that happen <laughs> with newborns. Rolling down. Good, come back through center. Go ahead and hug both knees in towards your chest. And stretch your left leg long and keep your right knee hugging in. Feel the opposition, really pulling one leg in and reaching one leg away. Circle the ankle. Good. Draw the knee back in towards your chest and let's switch sides. Feel the length in the body, the opposition. And coming back in, let's roll onto our side. And you're gonna bend your bottom arm, kind of like a little pillow. Bring your shins so they're parallel with the side of your mat here. And bring your top arm on top so you're kind of like a little book. Now keep your knees stacked, keep your shins stacked. And as you inhale, you're gonna just open the book. So it's called open book stretch and you're letting your chest open towards the sky. Your knees are still reaching forward towards me. And you're feeling that delicious stretch in your back and across the front of your chest, closing it back down. Let's do three of those. Nice big inhale, feel the opening, opening against that forward shoulder syndrome, right? Where we're always looking at our phones, looking at our computers, driving. Here we're opening and reversing that, that negative forward posture. And coming back in one more time. Open and breathe. Feels so good. And close. So from here, let's push ourselves up to seated coming into a mermaid seated position, mermaid stretch. So we're in a Z sit, nice long diagonal line with the arms. Take an inhale, exhale, round over, reaching for that opposite hand. Good, you're trying to draw both sit bones down into the mat. Open back up towards me, lift up and counter stretch. Good, okay, let's go down to the other side for our open book stretch. Resting on one arm, knees come forward, shins come forward. Stacking your arms here. Take a nice big inhale. You're gonna open that chest, open the upper back. 
Notice if it feels different than the other side. And close back down. Good. Inhale, open. And exhale, close. One more time, nice big opening. And exhale, close. And pushing yourself up, coming into a mermaid stretch so you're in a Z-sit position. Finding that long diagonal line with your arms, take an inhale. Exhale, rounding through the back and reaching for the mat. Both sit bones are drawing down into the ground. Breathe into the back side of the body. Good, open back up. Counter stretch. And let's turn to face the end of our mat with our legs straight, up, straight in front of us. Sit up nice and tall, arms come straight forward. If you need to bend your knees, totally fine. Take an inhale and as you exhale, nod your chin. Spine stretch forward, reaching beyond those toes. So not down, but out, feeling that deep C curve of your spine. Stack it back up one vertebra at a time, inhale. Exhale, stretch and round forward. Stack your spine back up. Last one, reaching and lengthening your spine. And back up, release the arms, and you're done for the day. I hope you enjoyed this quick stretching routine. This is something you can come back to again and again, either before a workout, after a workout, or just when you need a break in your day to move your body. So keep up the good work, you guys. I'll see you back on your mat very soon.